Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm IT Explosive One. And we have a very special guest with us this week. His name is Remjob. Oh my God. How can you ever deny that voice? <laughs> exactly. Don't you ever. All right, let's crack into another one. Uh, how do y'all feel about communism? <laughs> Jonas, you know what? <laughs> it's, a good, it's a good time. You know, I like the flags. <laughs> Yeah, they're they're really nice flags. I'm gonna have to say is that I feel like communism got the vibe right though, right? <laughs> okay, explain. I want to hear like, this. Like, okay, so think about it. If I wanted somebody to decorate my apartment, I don't want a Democrat doing it. I definitely don't want a Republican doing it. I don't think I want a demo. I don't think I want a, a what a dictator doing it. Nah, they're going to be too much about themselves. Monarch, you don't want that. Communism, though? But communism is a dictator. Uh, no, I'm, I mean, come on, not really. I think it's not necessarily, but usually. In, yeah. in theory, it's not, but it kind of divulged yeah. into that. All right. But I feel like, in theory, communism is like very, it's like for the people. You got the whole laissez fair feel to it. <laughs> and, and when you think of it, look at the vibe that Russia has. That's a cool vibe. Russia is not communist. They used Kinda, to be. Yeah, right? they used to be in the 80s. Yeah, but it was a cool vibe back then. Was That's it? Like, yeah. Soviet right. Union, that was sick, yeah. Yeah, yeah. hammer yeah. sickle, the red on That's yellow, it. good hey, colors, it does. It does the whole, sick. like, dark tapestries and, like, you know, the whole... This a cool feel. Yeah, like it's a little the for, like, foreboding. Our fucking flag is just stars. And, yeah. like, they have like weapons on there. Honestly, our flag, our, our flag is kind of pussy. Yeah. Wow. I'm that's, gonna be the one to say. Like Mexican flag is sick, dude. We could do something like that. Don't they have like a, an eagle eating yeah. a snake an on eagle it? Eating yeah. a snake, dude. Thank yes. you. Give so us like all like we that. have is is uh, Betsy Ross sewing up stripes, <sighs> and Mexico's like has animals eating animals on it. Yeah. Exactly, and then oh, you got like we tools. Can, we tools. can do better. Yeah. Tools on the communist. I mean, I'm gonna chop down some goddamn tall branches or what bamboo. You, what do you got on? Communism? Oh, anyways, communism. So North Korea, hip hop hopping in place to live. I hear. Um, <laughs> Very cool vibe. Don't yeah. agree with their policies. Cool vibe though. Yeah, yeah. So they. I just saw that they um, sentenced two 16 year old boys oh, yeah. to 10 years of hard labor. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. You would think they, I mean, you know, they probably did something pretty awful. Do you want to try to guess what they did? Do you know the answer did to this? Did they, like, to? throw out his photo or something? Or Oh, uh, you talking about Kim Jong-un? Oh, yeah. talked bad about him? or th- no. Yeah, or something. No, it's, it's not like an Elijah they Muhammad. They were listening to, like, it's K-pop not, or something. It's not like the Prophet Muhammad type of deal. It's <laughs> close, close, well, it close. Last, close. I can see how you get him confused. Yeah. What was the last thing you said? Uh, they were listening to K-pop or something. Ooh, Actually, very close. They got ten years in a labor camp very for close. watching South Korea South Korean drama shows. Yeah. Mm. K dramas. K dramas. Yeah. And here's the thing: they they sentenced them in a stadium full of people, so they could like make an example out of them. Like they brought a bunch of like teenage girls in, <laughs> and then they like handcuffed them and took them off to the labor camp for watching like Who's the Boss. Saved by the Bell. Yeah. Well, K dramas I mean, are a little bit more than that. Yeah, maybe it was worth it. Were they anti government? There, I hear they're really good. Honestly, yeah. no. I mean, I wouldn't say they're anti government, but you know, they're they get a little bit more involved. K dramas are kind of nuts. They're I don't like know if fresh, you've ever seen fresh them. off the Freedom yeah. Press, and like you know, they ain't down for that. Dude, I'm wondering how they're even doing it, right? Because you can't get like you don't have access the to internet. the internet, and yeah. like. So that means that they had to be one of the kids in the more affluent neighborhoods because there's only certain areas that are actually like uh, not gentrified, but like up modern. There's only yeah. a, not with you know, nah. no, that's well, pretty. Yeah. No, no, they got a cousin that lives in South Korea. He <laughs> meets been them at the edge for of a while. Uh, the, the, <laughs> the, 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 the demilitarization zone. He throws it. He hands him a USB drive through the fence, yes. and he takes it home, plugs yeah. it in. I mean, it's it's actually have to, they have to do it. I saw like one video where they had some K-pop performers come to North Korea. Have y'all seen this. this? I've seen this, yeah. And they like are performing and they're doing their whole dance and everything. And the crowd, the crowd is sitting there like stone faced. Yeah. And they have no, they just can't understand it. And it was just like such a, it was just like crazy to watch. That is, I mean, that is how they're, uh, they're supposed to behave. Yeah. It's a very, it's, it seems like in North Korea, it's a very controlling type of, that's like a true dictatorship. Almost it's like a true monarchy, yeah. if anything. Cause. Well, the shit's like, 
I mean, mm. what was that movie? The interview or something? What was oh, where it's Death Rogan. And yeah, and like they guys. wouldn't play it because they thought North Korea was going to start a war or something. Well, no, because they were making fun of uh, Kim Jong Un the whole yeah. thing. But like uh. a lot of it's like not accurate, but like the stuff where they talk about how Kim Jong Un doesn't poop and like he will go. Yeah. The funny thing, it's like the. What was it? He was. He like went and played golf and he had a hole in one on yeah, every single yeah. hole. He, 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 like, he golfed the perfect and game. And then you see him and you're like, you're, there's no Bro, fucking there's way. There's no way. There's yeah. no he way. He was sitting in the golf cart the whole time. Like, there's there's no he's way. like the guy who, yeah, who changes history to like, yeah. he's like, yeah, remember when I won the World Series? And they're yeah, like, you never actually, even played baseball. Death. Yeah. Like, it's it's just rewriting history every day. Well, and, there, was, there was like um, the North Korean soccer team like went to the World Cup or something. And, like, one of the dudes that had always been on there just wasn't there. And everyone thought that, like, he had been, like, taken to some prison or, like, some shit happened. And then he was there at the next one. So, apparently, he was fine or whatever. But it's, like, yeah, it's yeah, apparently, fine. apparently. Yeah, Apparently. But why was he gone for so long? Yeah. yeah. He was watching some K-pop. And he was like, yeah. yeah. I guarantee you that Kim Jong watches K-dramas, oh, too. Sure. That's what's crazy. As you know, he does. Yeah, he's does on the he? internet. He's surfing Reddit. Oh, and... he's living a Western culture life. 100%. Exactly. He's living a Western culture's life while everybody else is living in the 1990s. Look, look. I mean, yeah. seriously, you've seen enough footage. Yourself, if you're on the YouTube, you can probably see it unless we got copyrighted. But it was, <laughs> you see enough footage of, of it, and you're just like, it looks antiquated. Everything looks very, very mm -hmm. just like 1990s Americana. Like For the, the internet, cars, dude, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You can say whatever shit, and you're not going to be recorded, and like get that posted on Twitter, like. Oh. And this is, and and when you think about the stuff that they actually show you, and it looks like that. That's the best that they have yeah. to show. That's the part that because they're very, very particular about what they show to mm -hmm. the rest of the world. And usually it's only from like the one city. I've, not, I've watched documentaries yeah. on it. And I'm sure you guys have, too. But it's very crazy is that that is the best mm -hmm. face that they can show us. And the people who have infiltrated tell you that the majority of North Korea is much, much different. It looks like a 60s sad Disney parade. Yeah. Yeah, even yeah, I would go with 60s too. Yeah. yeah, it does. It's like when they show you like like Eastern European, those like like really poor countries, and it's like they're mm -hmm. all like they're like wearing like clothes that like the Westerners wore in like the eighties. And yeah. you're just like, what the fuck happened? It's like, <laughs> it's like a moment in time. Like it's just, it's so interesting. It was like you were talking about like the documentaries, like what they and literally what they show is like the best possible shit. And mm -hmm. one of them I was watching, they go to like a, a library and there's all these kids on computers, and then you realize they're literally just staring at the screen. Like no one's typing, mm -hmm. no one's moving anything. One dude was moving around his mouse, but it was just the Google home screen. Yeah, and it's just fucking nothing. And happened. they cut his hand off so right after. Just out a of bunch that. of screens with the it's Google home crazy. screen. Nobody's yeah. allowed to move yeah. anything. Yeah, so it's just like they have they have no idea how to use it. And no. Like they obviously aren't like on yeah. a regular basis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just it's it's crazy shit. Yeah, it's, it's it's insane. Like I can't even imagine. Well, and here's the thing: is like. The people who live there, they, they, I think what they do is they try to keep them from knowing any better, oh, so that so they don't have an uprising, right? Like you don't know what you're missing. You, you watch K-pop once and you're like, holy shit, and that they need to cut that off. Like, they yeah, can't. it's like that movie, The Village, where like they're living in like a in like a really, 17th yeah, century really town, and then like you find out like they're just yeah, that's it. That was a, I don't know. I read the I'll do this thing with movies I don't actually want to watch is I'll just read the synopsis. Okay, I remember reading the synopsis of that and being like, this is fucking <laughs> stupid. Like <laughs> it very. I didn't watch it either because it looked dumb. But yeah, so it's, yeah, it's it's essentially that or like you know like people like the indigenous tribes that live in the middle of nowhere like mm -hmm. they're living these like archaic lifestyles of like living in the jungle. Have you guys uh, heard of the, heard of that lady who defected from Korea or from North Korea? What's her name? Like Yo Ming? Yo Ming I don't know. Park. I didn't hear. She did Rogan. She did uh, yes, Flagrant. Yes, I saw this. And yeah. she was telling them about some of the stuff that happened to her family just for her to defect. Apparently, like a bunch of her family members got killed. Yeah. She was talking about some of the. Oh, because uh, she left. Yeah. Yeah. And she was talking about even like her lifestyle there, how they would have to eat insects and rodents and stuff. And I. I've seen footage of the of the way children are treated out there. There's some ill shit going out in well, North Korea. They're Korean in like America. famine. Yeah, yeah. like yeah. like perpetually. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and it's and just, just wild because they portray themselves as this big, strong, powerful nation, and they're really like super poor. How and do like, they, how do they get nukes, dude? How like I'm just confused. He's trying to are, get are they them. trying, but because like, they have a UAP, man. 
Right. They got a U. They're one of the ones who has a UAP. Oh, the alien things? Yeah, they got oh, one. yeah. They, they got, got one. one. You see it. <laughs> I can, I've seen the Tic Tac video. I can, I can see it. <laughs> they got a UAP. But no, I have heard North Korea is a great place to visit. You never want to leave. Um, you can't, yeah, because they won't you let can't you. leave. But, <laughs> but no, or at least that's what they'll tell the, yeah, the authorities. That's, yeah, that's what I hear from the people that visit. Like, I don't Jonas, hear from them. oh, he wants to stay forever. Where yeah. is he? He's fine. Yeah, he's just, they're texting on your phone. Yeah. Like, clearly. He's fine. He's all good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I mean, I'm fine. I'm all good. I am having yeah. a great time watching American TV. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Dukes of Hazard, number one new show. <laughs> so I don't know, dude. It's, it just blows my mind that. But I guess, like, sometimes the oppressed don't even realize how oppressed they are. Oh, 100%. Like, like Stockholm You have no syndrome. idea. Yeah. And they view him as, like, a literal god, too. So it's like... And they, and they I mean, just think, do like, or Branson... You, you like live this. in perpetual yeah. poverty. But no, it is wild. Like, they, like, the leaders live completely different lives. Like, then... I mean, what was the shit about... I mean, on Osama country. bin Laden's hard drive, they found, like, friends and, yeah. like, all these fucking yeah. random American shows and, yeah. like, The Simpsons and shit. And it's just like... Yeah, yeah, he's out here kill the American pig dogs. Yeah. And he's, like, he's out here just Crazy. watching, like, Friends yeah. and The Simpsons. It's just wild. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's insane. Well, it's like that whole it's do as I say, not as I do, right? Yeah. Like they they want the power and control. What the hell is? Dude, I will say they can say? fucking high step, dude. God damn. Like, yeah, if you're missing, if you're not watching the YouTube, you're missing out. Unless it got, <laughs> they are yeah, literally they're dancing the weirdest I've ever seen. This guy's slapping his. <laughs> his all right, all right. Yeah, all right, that's all the time we have for this episode. Go to crazetown.com for Jonas. T and Rem job. Uh, we out.